Well, it's a cold morning here in February of 2020, February 15th to be exact. One of the problems of caching in the winter is that snow can make it a lot harder to find geocaches. And you see behind me there's still lots of snow in my backyard. About half of it has melted here in Denver. We've had a lot of snow this February. But I looked at some uh, web cameras to find out where might there be some areas that don't have so much snow and I found that out east of the city area, about 20 miles, there's no snow at all. So I'm going to head out there today and see how many caches I can find. I actually have 98 caches on my list and uh, if it proves to be true that there's no snow out there, I should be able to find the majority of those. Uh, it's very early in the morning right now, it's about 24 degrees and uh, it's supposed to be in the 40s today so it should be uh, a pretty decent day for caching out there. Well, now I've arrived 50 or 60 miles east of home, east of Denver. You can see this area has no snow whatsoever. It does have a lot of cows in the distance. And this is the road, and I met the very last of the Something Fun series. It's called Something Fun Comes to an End. And if I'm not mistaken, it's right here. So this is the last of the series. I'm actually starting here. This is the first one I found. And uh, I'll sign the log and we'll move on to the next one. The uh, weather is beautiful out here. A little chilly. Around 30 degrees. But like I said, there's no snow to worry about. It's going to be a great day. See how quick of a find this one's going to be. 30 feet. Tumbleweeds. A lot of these are these little tiny things, but this one looks like it's a little pill bottle. Here it is at the base of this post. Not a good find. There are hundreds of caches out here on the eastern plains of Colorado. They're uh, often found by base of fence posts, by telephone poles, uh, sometimes they're pill bottles, sometimes they're uh, little mil tiny milliliter containers that are stuck on fence posts. This one I suspect is by a telephone pole. I'm going to go look for it here right now. Thirty feet, getting closer, twenty feet. Let's see, the fun is the hunt. The fun is in the find. Oh, here's a random post, and there's the container. Looks like a little film canister. We'll sign the log and move on to, to the next one. Here's my cash mobile. Just parked alongside the road. I haven't seen another person out here yet today since I turned off on the on the side road here. Quite pleasant actually. This next one appears to be over by the fence here. Let's take a look, see if we can find it. Maybe by this post. Oh, yes. There we go. Oh look, there's actually two caches here. This one. And this one. So I ended up signing the log in this cache. The one in here is soaking wet and this had a nice fresh log in it. I was the third to sign it. Definitely the better choice in this case.
far. This is my 51st uh, attempt at a cache today. Looks like it's a classic guardrail hide. Just behind me here. Go for it right now. tubes. Every one of them has been a micro, but uh, that's okay. They're fun too. I still haven't seen a single other car and I don't know how many miles I've driven. My 51st hide, still haven't seen another person. I did see two antelope, but that's about it. The old cash by the yellow sign trick, I think. Maybe. Actually, it might be past the sign. You can see where we are. MCR, Morgan County Road, I think it is. A. It's the old cash by the fence post trick. this one either. Well, anytime you go out for a bunch of caches, you're bound to have a, a DNF or two. In fact, I've had several today. Oops. Looks like I found it after all. It's one of these guys. It... Time for another stop at this intersection. Looking for another one in the Something Fun series. It's over here. Maybe by this pole. Oops, I think I see it. <clears throat> yes, that's it. down that way next. Several more down that way in the Something Fun series. Well, I've completed my trip for today. I found 80 caches. Pretty good day of caching. One of my bigger days. Not my biggest, but uh, biggest in a long time. It was great being out here in the countryside. Hardly saw anybody else. I think I saw four cars go by, one just a few minutes ago. Uh, I did run into some uh, detours back here where I had to skip a few caches because the road was closed. But well, that's okay. There's always another day for those. Uh, I'm still out in the middle of nowhere. This is uh, farming land here. It's all been plowed, just a dirt field at the moment. But it is uh, middle of February, so it, what do you expect? So thanks for joining me on this trip today, in this video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and take a look at my other videos. Uh, I look forward to another trip and another video sometime soon. Take care, everybody. Bye.